shall we go and get the first outfit? Have you got an itch? Oh. <laughs> yes! She forgets where I she is. I have. I'm sorry. Hmm? Oh, hmm. hmm. I think either one you need to do a bit more nicely. What? <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Oh, you're giving drag through a hedge backwards currently. Have you brushed it? <laughs> <laughs> the truth is, I nearly was dragged through a hedge literally on my run yesterday. Why? I wasn't running. You nearly dragged you through a hedge? No, I was going through hedges when I was doing my walk. Oh, so way more dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? You said I was basically dragged through a hedge yes. on my run. Wasn't dragged through a hedge, didn't run. No, but I walked next to a hedge. Right. And that's okay. why I looked like this, because it was raining at the time. You walked next to a hedge. <laughs> Autumn is upon us. Don't do the sad lip. We've got to embrace it. <laughs> we can't leave. <laughs> you know what? What? You really can. I mean, nothing beats blue skies, but you can get blue skies in autumn. Currently, it's not blue. Mm. But nothing beats... Don't know what I was going to say. <laughs> Nothing beats the blue skies, but you know if you truly like try to embrace the best things of the season you're in, yeah, you can kind of get on board with it. Because last year I really tried to embrace autumn. Yeah. You know, like the cozy vibes and the nice smelling cleaning products. Yeah. <laughs> and you can kind of get on board with it, even if it's not quite your vibe. Okay? So this video, hopefully, is going to get us into the vibes. We're going to find some cool outfits that we can wear in autumn. We've picked out five autumn outfits each that we're going to show you. We don't know what each other's is either, so we're going to show each other. All right, can I just give some background here? Why? Because... <laughs> what? Sorry, I didn't mean to say why. <laughs> because why? I want to. Why are you talking? <laughs> Sorry, what are you going to say? Okay, so my background is I was given five minutes, right, this is what we're doing and get some outfits together that's suitable for autumn. Yeah. I went to my dressing room and without even thinking, I pulled out five mix and match outfits for an autumn wardrobe. Okay, girlfriend. All of them have been worn already. Yeah. None of them are brand new. Yeah. Some of them far, far from being brand new are actually, we're talking about maybe years old yeah right and i believe i have the perfect mix and match winter wardrobe check you out i said winter i mean autumn she means I, autumn i haven't even got to winter yet she's ahead of the game time for a positive affirmation card yay right you ready yeah i'm gonna have that one <gasps> oh that's good that's fabulous you ready yeah i have everything i need to face any obstacle Oh, <laughs> I, did. I was trying to not show you my monkey nails. Oh dear. Yeah, they got damaged on my wall. Oh. Shall we go and get the first outfit? Have you got an itch? Oh. <laughs> yes. She forgets where I she is. I have. I'm sorry. I think we should go get the first outfit on. Yeah, okay, let's do it. <laughs> I'll see you back here in a sec. Yes. Oh, I'm liking the leopard and. Do you? You can't see it yet. No. Had I better get over there and show should. it up. Right, okay. And a roll neck. Oh, we love yeah, a roll we neck. Love a roll neck. Okay, oh, yeah. so this is very much like an everyday, you might be going out to work, might be going out for a drink later on in the evening, something yeah. like that. Yeah. I feel like you could wear this, you don't necessarily need a jacket, yeah. because we're in autumn, so yeah. it's not a necessity. Mm -hmm. You could get away with just maybe having a, um, like a big... Scarf. chunky scarf or something mm. around your neck yeah um and so i'm keeping it neutral but i think i'm keeping it trendy yeah absolutely can you talk us through where everything's from please oh shit <laughs> now if they would had that brief earlier i'd have checked where they were from i can tell you everything apart from a skirt i don't okay. know where you got your skirt from okay i think i can tell you where the skirt's from oh awesome i think Great the skirt team. was from new look last winter was it i think so yes oh nice yes I like that. And it's sort of one of those that's just cut, so it just sort of goes out a little bit at yeah, the bottom, but lovely. it's quite slim at the top. Yeah. Uh, I think this was from Zara. Yes, it is. This was my Primark bag. Yeah. I have these boots that were from... Pretty Little Thing. Pretty Little Thing. Got those last year. And, um, oh, look, yeah, they're oh, sugar. slightly over the knee. Wow. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? I love that because then your legs are warm. So flipping lootly. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah. Right? So if I put a big chunky scarf on this, basically I can go anywhere, can't Absolutely. I? Absolutely. Love so, it. Yeah, thank you. You're looking autumnal. Well, autumnal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to look autumnal. <laughs> I 
probably wear more gold jewellery or something. I might yeah. even add a big chunky gold necklace or something if I yeah, wanted to nice. zhuzh it up a bit. Spice it up. Like but you know, it. I did only have five minutes to get ready, so that's why yeah. I haven't done that. Well, you know, you said you've got five minutes. I'd only just decided before that, so I also created all these outfits this morning on a whim. High five me that, sister. So most of them we haven't even worn like this. Right, okay. So this is like it's quick fire last minute shoes. <laughs> And you know what's you. ironic? If we ever need to go out anywhere, yeah. finding an outfit is tough. It takes hours. It takes days of preparation. Yeah, but let me tell you why that is. Why? Because there is an emotional content in an outfit. Right. So it depends on what you're going to as how you want to feel. Oh, and okay. that's why it can take a while to plan something. Okay. So basically you have more boxes to tick. Correct. When you know the occasion yes. specifically. Yeah. Talk to me. This is totally random this morning okay right my beige linen trousers yeah i feel like currently we can still take our linen into water yeah it's not so freezing yeah we can't do that yeah just a plain white t-shirt which desperately needs an iron ironically i did all my ironing the other day but just not this sorry just a minute hold it the flipping press hours. i had two massive piles i ironed it all and put it all away you don't iron no, I have a pile of things that need to be ironed, and if I need to wear them, then I iron it. Oh. I don't usually do the ironing, but I thought, you know what, no, I'm going to do it. <laughs> and I did. It took me two episodes of Love is Blind. Oh, no, really? Yeah. But How lovely for you, because when I start the ironing, I'm often there from this morning <laughs> all the way through to the chase. <laughs> We're talking six hours worth. <laughs> this was Primark a few years ago. I got it in a bigger size because um, I always thought of wearing it like this, never wore it, so I put it in a selling pile for Vinted years ago, and then a few months ago I thought, oh my god, did I ever sell that grey vest? I didn't, I got it back out, and now I love it, and I'm wearing it. Now you're loving life. I'm loving it, so I'm really glad I didn't get rid of it. Yeah. I've got my brown trainers on, Yeah. which I got these for my birthday, and I wear them all the time with everything. They're so neutral, they go with everything. They are, and I just think for autumn they're perfect. Yeah. And then my coach bag. Outfit number two. Ta-da! Oh, we've both gone for a bit of leopard this oh, time. Oh, yeah, you look lovely. That's so nice. So do you, and You look dressy this time. Do I? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, I have the same boots on as before. Very versatile. I have these three-quarter red trousers that I got from Zara. Yeah. I have uh, this little Lulu Guinness bag, sort of tying it all together, yeah. along with this leopard print pussy bow shirt that I got <laughs> from Primark. <laughs> Why did you say it like that? Because I can't say pussy bow, because it like, makes me cringe. <laughs> so instead you say pussy bow. <laughs> I love it. It looks great. Does it? Yeah. Thanks. Really like it. That is like a pow statement outfit. I feel great in it. You look great in it. Now... It gets cold, right? Yeah. Then I just put a big black coat over the top of it. Yes. It's warm, not a problem. This is very light. Yeah. Quite sheer, actually, so I borrowed your uh, black vest top to go underneath it. Yeah. Currently, it's cutting off my circulation, but we <laughs> won't worry about that. And, um, yeah, I feel like this is an, an, an awesome look yeah. for anything. Absolutely. Really like it, and I look like I've got business on my mind. Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's stylish. It's a shame I didn't wash my hair this morning, otherwise I'd really <laughs> look great. <laughs> you and me both, sister. Oh, I was going to say, that ah. slick back pen that we were slated in the Primark call, oh. to quote, Andrea called it as dry as a badger's ass. <laughs> it's actually quite good. Is it? Yeah, I used it today from scratch, so instead of having anything in my hair first, I scraped my hair back and then I did the brush thing, and it did work. So I'm thinking, you know, to keep it in your bag for when you need it, yeah, like, yeah. it does work. That's I a great idea. I just thought I'd put that out there. Oh, that's good, because I feel better about that now. Yeah. Because I wouldn't want to put people off if it was good. Exactly, and that's why I wanted to say it. We'll yeah. mention it in the next Primark call in case nobody sees this. Yeah. But, yeah, I just thought I'd mention that. Okay. Um, okay, I've got my leopard print trousers on. I love that. These are Stradivarius. Had these a while and they serve me well through summer. Yeah. So I think it's nice that you can also take them into autumn, winter. Are they denim? Um, how do you know? They feel like Do they denim. feel like jeans? Yeah. Yeah, they are then. Yeah. They look like denim. Yeah, they, they feel like it. I think they must be it. <laughs> I love with that particular leopard print, mm. it's so neutral with everything else that you've yes. got. So it doesn't look like Rod Stewart's walking into the building. Right. That's a bonus. Because <laughs> that wasn't the look I was going for. <laughs> um, yeah, for some reason, this whole, like, 
brownie taupey beigey thing i've got a lot of stuff like that and i can mix and match it yeah. really well which is nice i think that's also why these shoes come in handy because yeah. they just go with all my outfits yeah um so i've got the same white t-shirt on as well yeah this was h&m don't know if i said that before and this i think was also no actually it was monkey last year okay and it's really nice because it's so baggy and snuggly this yeah. is one of those snuggly jumpers same bag you look great. Job done. Thank I'm, you. I'm looking at you thinking you're going shopping. Oh, well, am I? Clothes shopping. Oh, that sounds great. And then I'm going to meet you for cocktails later. Ah, I like it. <laughs> we, not only do we like look awesome, but we also plan our days. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. Should we go for number three? Yeah, let's do that. Oh, I'm liking this one. <laughs> so these are very thick yes. material to this, although stretchy. Yeah. So I've got these three quarter capri pants. Where from? Kate Spade. Nice. With these very lovely uh, ballet pumps in black. From Coach. From Coach. Yeah. The colour in here is black, green, pink and like a, almost like a lime green as yes, well. Yes it is, yeah. So I picked out the green with this jumper from Marks and Spencers. Yeah. And I got my Primark bag. Love that. Just to bring it all together. Really like that, and I can have a little vest top underneath if it gets super, super hot. Yeah. Or I can put a nice big black scarf around if I get cold. Yes, perfect. I really like it when people are able to bring colour into the colder months. Yeah. Because I can't do it. I don't know why. I really struggle to do it. But you've pulled that off amazingly. Thank you. Yeah. And I know that it's cosy warm because I had it last year when yes. it was cool. So I know that that works. Yeah. So I'm on the same colour palette as before. Yeah. <laughs> no surprises there. Well, the thing is, Bob, so if we're going to mix and match, we're going to mix and match, right? Yeah, I mean, it makes the mixing and matching easier. Yeah. Um. So I've got my Zara jeans on yeah. that I had last year, maybe the year before. Love these and I get a lot of wear out of these. And somebody in the wardrobe SOS got some wide leg black trousers and they were asking what do I do with them yeah and I said wait till autumn winter because I wear mine all the time yeah here they are yeah um so I've just got the same trainers on black top usually I'd have my long sleeve black top I haven't put that on I've just put this short sleeve one on because if I put that black one on hair makeup everything's of coming course. off yeah. it's got a tight hole around the neck <laughs> so um <laughs> For the purpose of the video, I thought, let's not do that too soon. Right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, and then this coat, yeah. I honestly, whenever I leave the house and it's cold, this is what I stick on. Apart from if it's raining, because if it's raining, it's so close to the floor. Super long, yeah. You risk it getting damp. Yeah. Where's it from? It was from ASOS, from a brand called Object, I want to say 24, it could be 21. Object 20 something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you look very cosy. Thank you, Anne. I'd like to say with the mix and match, because people might be thinking, well, hold on a minute, how mm. are you going to mix and match that outfit? Yeah. Because it's so bright. Yeah. But of course, I had the black roll neck, didn't That's I? That's true, and that would work. And then I'm about to put on something, or some other things, that this green would happily sit with. Yeah. So, same handbag. Yeah. And my black pumps would go with every outfit that I've got. Yeah. So, actually, proper mix and match what number are we on one two three four four's number next four. let's go okay oh and this is gorgeous thank you oh i love what's this <laughs> i love this i've not seen this before <gasps> go and show us full length please okay okay let's show you full length this is cute right i've got an emily in paris oh yeah i think anyway absolutely so yeah. i picked this tiered um net skirt shawl that's quite chul. Yes. Skirt up in Spain. Yeah. And then this jacket is from hmm, Zara. Beautiful. And uh, then this top is one shoulder on, one shoulder off. Yeah. Cute. It's really thick. Yeah. I'm a bit conscious at the moment because I'm a bit bloated. Oh, but don't be silly, Anne. I know, and I'm trying to embrace the bloat, but it's hard when the <laughs> stripes go that way. But anyway, I just think it's really quite a cute outfit. It looks and amazing. And these cute little uh, ballet pumps to go with it. Yeah, that is such a cute outfit. Where's your stripy top from? Well, that's a very good question, Bobby. Because I can't remember. I've not seen it before, and it's ever so soft. I know. Oh, I think it's around here. Oh, hang on. Oh, she's under my armpit. Lab. Oh, I saw it. And do you know, it came with a massive red flower there, like oh. huge. But actually, on reflection, yeah. it looks like a tent 
It's so big. Oh, do you? So I'm probably going to ditch the flower is what I thought. Yeah. Maybe put a little black flower on there if I was just wearing it without the jacket. Yeah. Or potentially put a little flower onto the jacket oh, that'd be here. Cute. Yeah. Maybe have it sort of here. Yeah. And that would tie it all in together. Yeah. I really like that. You know, if I'm in one of those moods where I want to be pretty and pretty, and, do you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. and, and like just walking around, spinning around all the time, yeah. then I would put on something like this and it oh, makes me feel all cheery. It looks awesome. Thank you. And it's like, it's perfect for autumn because it's too much for summer. Yes. So it's like, yes. you wear it in autumn. Yes. And I'm not adverse to wearing black. Yeah. I love wearing black. Yeah. But I'm very drawn to wearing black with a pop. Yes. And that's very striking. Yes. This is an amazing colour. I know. Right, come on then, lady. You okay. look great. I'm on a different vibe to Andrea. So we're probably not meeting up today. But I've got to get a tracksuit out for autumn. Do you know what I mean? It would be wrong for me not to. You look super cute in that. Thank you, Andrea. So this is a tracksuit from Lounge. Just a classic grey one. Same trainers. This jacket is TK Maxx and then my coach bag with the pink. And up until now, because I've not needed a jacket, I've just been going out with the tracksuit and the bag. Yeah. And it looks really cute with a bit of pink. Yeah. But I thought for an extra layer, this is nice. And these quilted jackets are very in. They are very in and it really suits you. I like it a lot. Thank you. That whole outfit is very you, isn't it? It's so somehow, cozy. yeah. Somehow you look comfy. Yeah. But um you don't look too casual either. Even oh, though, okay. you know, this is very casual. Yeah. When you put this jacket on, somehow it doesn't look like that anymore. I have a theory with this. Oh. You can wear what you want as long as you've got your hair and makeup done. You look put together. Literally, as long as I've got mascara and my lippy on, I feel like I'm dressed. There you go then. This guy the other day, he um, was, <laughs> it's so funny. Oh, I saw you all dressed up. And I said to your husband, I'm not being funny, but when I saw her last time and she just looked like she'd come out of bed, she was very standard. <laughs> That's what he said. I thought, number one, you're cheeky. Nobody's ever called me standard before. And then he says, now I look at you like a supermodel. I thought, right, your views on how people look, one, is of no consequence, and two, you're standard to supermodel. I'm somewhere in between, you know what I mean? Let's not kid that ourselves. Hilarious. So funny, I laugh for days. <laughs> I it's laugh the today. word standard. I know. I've never heard anybody be described as that. I know. I mean, I suppose if, in his eyes, if that was the worst I was going to look was standard, <laughs> then, I mean, he kept saying, it's a compliment. I thought, <laughs> darling, you've got to stop talking. Just stop it now. It's not how you wear it. No, it is how you wear it. What? <laughs> it's not what you wear, it's how you wear it. There you go. Mm. Right, last outfit. Is this the last one? Yeah, this is number four. So oh my God. number five to go, yeah. <laughs> okay. The grand finale. Ta -da! Oh, we've both gone blazers. Oh, we have. Watch out, because I've gone bonkers now. <laughs> Ta -da! Black staple. Mm -hmm. Stick on a loud jacket. Yeah. Whack on a very loud bag and ma matching shoes. Polka dot. Yeah. Polka wow. dot. I love it. Do you? Yes. The red and polka dot yeah. is a vibe. Yeah, I agree. So I just want you to think about something though. Mm -hmm. The leopard print skirt. The first one. Yeah. Yeah. That would look awesome with this top and this jacket, mm -hmm. right? And the little black pumps and black bag. Yeah. The green jacket yeah. would look awesome with this outfit. Yeah. The frilly skirt yeah. would look great with this roll neck top. Uh-huh and spotty bag and shoes yeah so when i was talking about the mixing and matching yeah the leopard print take this top off put leopard print underneath would yeah. look great with this the thing is black it's, shoes it's getting your basics yeah when you've got your basics like a plain black roll neck and your plain black trousers yeah. then you can have the things that yeah. tick you fancy like the louder jacket yeah because everything is interchangeable mm -hmm. whereas if you have too many like pattern things or all different multicolored things yeah then it's harder yeah i agree but i love that thanks so this i think is the only new thing that i've put on right the other stuff is all either months or years old okay this is my new jacket that i showed in the last video <laughs> yeah um 25 quid was yeah, it yeah yeah love this for autumn winter yeah with my cardigan that was last year's Primark. Yeah. Wear this all the time and I just thought it goes nicely together. I did also pick up this because my original thought was to do grey 
top i've got a long sleeve one of these as well underneath it because so i think that would look cute mm. um the reason i didn't again was because of the head hole mm. so i thought if i can get away with the cardigan i'm gonna do that yeah jeans these are new look yeah years old and same shoes i yeah. haven't picked up my bag but i'd probably just wear the same bag as i have for the other outfits yeah 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 well a person i think we smashed it yes yeah, what's your favorite outfit bobby <sighs> My favourite outfit of yours, I think, has to be... I really like the Emily in Paris. What the number green. was that? That was number four. Yeah, I think that was, for me, my least expected one. And like, wow, that looks really cool. Okay. So I think probably that one. Okay, cool. Of yours, I think... Do you know what? I like the jogging suit with the blue... Really? Yeah, with the blue padded jacket. That was just my... Oh, chuck that one in there. Yeah, one. but I looked at you and I just thought, oh, that is so cool. I love oh, that. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> Let us know in the comments what's yeah. your favourite then. Yeah. One, two, three, four or five. Can't remember which was which, but rewind if you need to. Yeah, we will. <laughs> There's loads of new ones put on the shout out. Did you write them down? Uh, yeah, I'm getting a bit confused though because people are asking for birthdays and shit like that and I ain't got no calendars for that. <laughs> you better tell them. <laughs> you know, last week I said, oh, this girl, bless her, she didn't even ask for a shout out. She just messaged saying it was her birthday so she was excited the video was coming out. I thought, you know what, I'm going to give her a shout out. Well, I'm eating my words now because I've had, I've had messages left, right and centre. It's my birthday on this day, can I have this video? And I'm thinking, oh dear, I think I've bit off more than I can chew. <gasps> she doesn't have a calendar to be able to write everybody's birthday. I've got shout in. outs coming out of my ears. Have you? I have, but I, I want to make sure everybody gets what they want. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm a people pleaser. I know, but you've got to be realistic, Bobby. <laughs> I know. I'm going to try my best with it. I am. And what I worry about with the birthday shout outs is if you miss one, then you're going to feel bad about I know, yourself. I know, I know. So we just got to ride yeah. the wave. Yes. But this one, it, it's the next one on the list. We're going to go with this okay. one, okay? Yeah. Today's shout out goes to. Catherine and, and her, her baby, baby Eleanor. Eleanor. This is cute, right? Yeah. They recently found our channel and now watch every week. We helped her get through her maternity, which can sometimes be a lonely time. I've just teared up. That is so precious. And and their mother and daughter and they watch it together. And That's Ele adorable. Eleanor has no choice in the matter. Is Eleanor Eleanor's a baby? Being, she's being bought up on the, oh the God. God Diaries, God help her. <laughs> Have you seen, this is terrible really, when the children are given the telephone and they say you can say any word you want in oh. this bathroom, any word at all and you won't be told off and then they go out, they shut the door and these angels say the worst words that it's are possible so to say. It's so bad but it's so good. It's so, <laughs> so, I mean, you just want to go, no. No. But then, then you can't They've heard it somewhere. I know. Andrea, mm? if they haven't already, then what do they need to do? Well, if you don't do these, I'm not doing it again. Uh, shout, like, uh, shout. subscribe, <laughs> comment, share us with more than one friend now, at least two or possibly three, and check us over on TikTok and Instagram, because if you didn't have us down already, you missed me running my marathon yesterday. Right, okay. We'd be so incredibly grateful if you yeah. do those five things. Yeah. And we'll see you next week at 5pm with a brand new video. Bye! <laughs>